Well guys, welcome back to Terraria. And I decided that I couldn't handle the whole stuff I went through last time. So what we're going to do is we are going to basically... Um, I haven't entered hard mode yet on this. That's literally all I have to, left to do is defeat the wall of flesh and that'll enter hard mode. So what we're going to do is so we're going to do just that. We will uh, see how it goes. First, we're going to, uh, you know, get all this stuff out the way. So this will be interesting. I'm going to completely abandon that other world. I might use it to um, farm some floating islands. Uh, that'll probably be the only thing I do with it. But other than that... Oh, this is placements. This needs to go here. Other than that, won't be doing anything with that world again. It was... I checked it out on the hardcore player. And, um... Just completely lost my train of thought. But... Yeah, so that's how that's going to go. Any more materials in here? Not really. Is this where I put all my mushrooms and stuff? No. No, quick stack. You know what? Let's just... No, I need to finish what I'm doing. Put my two cloud in the bottles. Need to get a shiny red balloon. Alright. Let's put my obsidian and stuffs up. Put my woods up. So what we're gonna need... Probably gonna need... This is location enemies. This is mining speed. I could also take damage because it's not back. We're gonna need that. Get rid of that. Um. So we'll walk on water. Increased air speed. Uh. Oh, we'll take those. This is all the stuff that I need to put up. The Worms Potion. I don't know. Don't think we'll need that. Pick up range for life hearts. Defense. We might want one of those. Alright, now what we're going to do is we're going to scroll down, 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 and go down. I probably need a hellstone or something to craft my obsidian helmet. Or skull, I mean. Oops. Where would an obsidian skull be? If I can't find it, I'll just look it up. So I don't remember right off the bat. Yeah, I'll be right back, guys. Okay, we are back. I don't even know if I paused it or if you guys just watched all that happen. I need to craft it at the furnace. Ta-da! So what can I replace? Oh, I don't need that. Whoops. Don't think I'll need that. I will need this though. I 
All right. That done. They're going here. No, I don't think that's. I don't remember where I put my obsidian. Well, I'll figure that out later. Yeah, this house is significantly less organized than my other one. I do apologize. However, I mean, at the same time, I'm not going to apologize because it's my house. So, yeah. Okay. Tungsten bars go down. Going to grab one of these. We'll grab two just in case I mess this up. We're going to fall down, down, down to the ring of fire. Yes, I basically just dug straight down from my house. At least almost to the point of uh, the underworld. Yes, I know there are ores like lead. There was demonite back there. But I don't need demonite. I have so much of it as it is already. It's almost ridiculous. But I don't know if I finish explaining this. What I'm doing with this is we're gonna do. I'm gonna do a playthrough with the soft core, the medium core, and the hard core. And I really don't want to do an entire another soft core. I know it would be better so you guys could see me build up, but obviously I do not believe there is a creative in Terraria, so obviously everything I have is legit, worked my ass off for most of this, it's quite a pain to get, actually, took me a while to get to here, I've been playing for about two weeks now, which I guess really isn't that long. Oh, I need to summon my minion. There we are. Yep, tip tip doodly doo. Up the lava thing we go. Um this way. This way. Down. Now we're not we're over halfway there. Let's get through all of this freaking cobweb. Yeah, I don't even have a sawmill on this one. If you guys saw my house, wall creeper, these things scared the shit out of me at first. They also murdered me at first because I was ill prepared. Alright, down we go. Alright, now because. This thing is extremely powerful. We are only going to be doing two things on the way there. One, we're going to push this way. Oh, this could be bad. I, yeah. Oh, come on. I don't have my shoe spikes. That's right. I'm so used to having those. I didn't realize how useful those were. God damn, I'm already taking tons of damage from these freaking Jesus buttholes. <sighs> yes, basically, the obsidian skulls and stuff like that doesn't hurt me. Because I'm an. You are a douchebag. And nothing but. Okay, we're going to quickly. How close am I to my shadow chest? Pretty far away. Okay. Yes, I have a shadow chest in here because I didn't pack my safe with me. I ran out of room, so I put some stuff in there. I like to collect my chests when I am done looting them. And onwards we go. It's still a creepy painting. Let's, let's just go underneath. Let's 
Come on. Off we go. Is this the one I need or is it the next one? It's three, four. So it's going to be after the big hellstone brick structure. All right. Grab that. Ooh, okay, that was a bit too close for comfort. Died there once. All right, here's the hellstone structure. Oh, where is my house? Here it is. Gosh damn it. Let me in. Fall. Fall. Shadow chest. Just head right click. Okay. So yeah, not really stuff that was necessary to my survival, as you guys could tell. Tis why I left it here. Wanted to come back for the chest, though. Basically, because I know how this fight's going to be with it pushing me and pushing me I want to make sure I can navigate which is why I have my lava charm and the obsidian skull so I can not worry about little stuff like that I'll obviously still have to keep an eye on it so I don't burn anyways but We'll get to that when we do. Alright, this is such a long way to go. Okay, so we're going to mine through this. So I don't have time for this. Another house on structure. Did I explore this one already? Oh yeah, this was the one with absolutely nothing in it. The one that I was very, very angry with. Alright. Continuing forwards. We got a demon torch. Very cool. Oh, this isn't going to work. All right, and chuk, chuk, chuk. all right. So we will get to where we need to be oh, in the video, and then we will start the fight. No, you don't be a douchebag. This is in my opinion probably one of the hardest bosses since the fact that he pushes you off the screen and such and you have to worry about not only him but all the hazards of the area and whatnot. All right. So much to navigate. Water walking potion, don't need that. I could use another obsidian skin potion. This is such a long way to go. So yeah, I think for the majority of the fight, I'm going to focus on arrows and probably my boomerang. I'm not going to try to get up close and personal. I need to be able to focus on what's around me as far as the environment goes so I don't end up dying because of that. So I would be very upset if that happened. All right, I think we're just about far enough. Let me get somewhere that's not gonna start killing me. All right, let us kill this douchebag, that douchebag. Alright, I think this should be far enough. 
a potion. Drink a potion. Drink a potion. Set all my potions. Yep. Alright, let us... How do I throw again? Five, and then like, T. Tyrant was slain while the flesh is awoken. Alright. We're gonna switch to my Hellfire Arrows. Actually, let's switch to my Jesters since they will penetrate. Oh my god, please stop. Oh my lord, this is bad. Alright, I'm sorry that I'm being so quiet, guys, but this is extremely nerve-wracking, and I'm trying to concentrate. Oh, my lordy. He's over halfway dead. He's got about quarter life left. Oh, this could be bad. Okay, that was helpful. Why did I hit H? Why did I hit H? Because I tried to heal. Please let I'm gonna come at you with my sword, bro. I'm gonna come at you with my sword. Oh, just kidding. Oh, I'm just kidding. Oh, I'm just kidding. Oh, I'm just kidding. Oh, I'm just kidding. Fuck! God damn it! So close. Alright guys, well when we come back we will have our second attempt at that. See you guys next time.